Hey guys, I've been wanting to record this for a while, but haven't had the chance, so I'm just taking a quick break here. Um, I'm your Tea Time Adventure, welcome back to my channel. And I wanted to tell you about one of the best values for money you can get when you decide you want to visit Amsterdam, and that is the I Amsterdam card. Now it comes with a variety of options. It comes in one, two, three, and I think four days. Um, but the best value for money is going to be if you have the ability to do the two or three days. Now you can see Amsterdam in about two to three days. Um, the nice little inclusion for the I Amsterdam card is that it does come with access to pretty much all of the public transit in Amsterdam. So you can use the tram system, metro, or um, a few of the trains, but I would be weary you can really just rely on the tram to get pretty much anywhere within city limits. Now, if you're planning to go outside of the city, like Harlem, Delft, Rotterdam, then you will have to buy a separate train ticket as you will with the um, transportation to and from the airport, Schiphol, which is only about five euros. Now, um, the, night, the I Amsterdam card does come with a one hour night cruise, which you can use at one of the places located within the pamphlet that they give you and it includes like almost every museum with the exception of maybe a few or uh, the smaller ones but um just make sure that if you're planning to get one you do have reservations ahead of time for the Anne Frank house and the Van Gogh museum those do tend to book out quite a bit in advance when I went I actually ended up buying uh, my tickets separately just because I didn't want to take any chances if you go all of that way across the uh, world, you might as well be guaranteed to able, guaranteed to enter those uh, museums. So this is what the I Amsterdam card looks like when you purchase it. On the back here, you'll notice that there is a barcode. You do not have to write your name on it or anything. It is active the first museum or attraction you choose to use and it would be good for however long your card is good for 24 48 72 96 or so forth now you will also receive the i amsterdam city card booklet and it does say get started enjoy your city card and it does have how to use the card if you're going to an attraction or museum you just have to present your card and it is active immediately. For public transit, you just have to tap the card in and out if you're using a tram. Um, museums, and it does go over all of the museums that are included, as I previously mentioned. Uh, the canal cruise, you have a couple different places you can use it. Let me just skip to the back here. There we go. This page is super useful for that. I ended up just using the um, Canal Tours by St. Roma and that's just because I found they have the most options available outside of Central Station. The other side here does have a list of all of the discounts and attractions. And a nice handy dandy map here of the beautiful city. Now you will notice that most of the city is pretty central here. You'll want to know that Central Station is where you are able to find most trams and sorry it's right over here that was my hotel. Um, most of the trams and buses as a starting point and Frank House is in this area museum quarter over here, the zoo, which is well worth it over here as well. Uh, here's all of the canal cruises and museums that you'll find with the number key here. And if you do have time and are going outside of the city center, everything is accessible by train. You will find Harleen is where there's quite a few of the tulips. Uh, castles and gardens. There are a few places, make this side bigger too, where you can use the card outside of the city center. You'll have to read everything. 
Now the I Amsterdam card can be purchased online ahead of time or you can purchase it in person when you get there. I always recommend doing your initial research and purchasing it when you get there, but it's always completely up to you. These are just some of the pictures of the many beautiful places you can visit when you're there. If you have other questions about the card, I'll be doing a blog post on our website, theteatimeadventure.com, that'll have more specific information. This is just meant to serve as a basic as to what the I Amsterdam card is. Enjoy the rest of these clips, and I hope that Amsterdam is a place that you will choose to visit and enjoy the I Amsterdam card as well. Until next time, don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned to our channel for more videos like this.